Good evening and welcome to Hungry Report, start of public media and once foreign language news hour. I'm Chenge Gabriela Iboya with today's news from Hungary in the Carpathian Basin. Let's begin. The number of people infected with the coronavirus in Hungary rose to 58. The data also shows that the epidemic has reached its second stage in Hungary when the spread of the virus to the community has started after individual infections. Together with the new patients, a total of nine Iranian, one British, one Kazakh and 47 Hungarian coronavirus infections have been recorded. There is and will be enough food and grocery items in Hungary. There is no need for bulk and panic purchases, the president of the National Chamber of Agriculture said. Balázs Györfi reminded us that the country is quite capable of self-sufficiency when it comes to basic food items. In the current situation, Hungarian producers are continuously able to provide the population with the required quantities. And it's not just food, there is enough medicine as well. Pharmacists say there is no need for bulking up because there is plenty of supply in factories, wholesalers and warehouses. However, in order to provide continuous care, doctors are asked to prescribe three months of medication on three different prescriptions instead of one. The Hungarian Prime Minister announced economic and job protection measures. Viktor Orban spoke on his social media page that till the end of the year, neither individuals nor companies would have to pay, pay off any loans. In addition, the government is already granting more incentives to protect jobs in tourism, hospitality, entertainment, sports and cultural services, as well as passenger transport sectors, which are already in serious trouble. Due to the coronavirus, migrant workers from Western Europe have left home, but only Hungarian citizens can now enter Hungary. As a result, on Wednesday, traffic on the Hungarian-Austrian border again paralyzed for hours. The government then decided, under controlled conditions, to allow transit traffic through Hungary on a predetermined route on the so-called humanitarian corridor. Well-known people, athletes and artists are already joining the government's information campaign titled Stay at Home. They all ask people for the same thing, attention and cooperation to stop the epidemic. They say that there isn't much to do other than everyone should and needs to stay at home. And that was Hungary Reports this evening, but you can catch us every night after 11 o'clock news and online as always. Do stick around and watch our German, Russian and Chinese language news. Thank you for watching this lovely evening and please stay indoors.